All right, this is a part two of the connection problems I'm having between the EcoFlow Smart Home Panel 2 and the uh, Delta Pro Ultra unit. I had reported this with customer service and they have sent me a new, brand new connection cable in the box and we are having the same problem. So just for reference, this problem happens in every one of the slots. You can see the pins are in good condition in one, two, and three. The pins, if you can see that, unobstructed, look like they're in good shape there. And that one, and on the DPU slot, the pins also look fine and straight and unobstructed. So when we go to plug it in, one user mentioned what happens if, and you can see here on my app none are showing connected and if I plug it in here and lock it in it does not recognize that anything is plugged in I did see one thing that was interesting currently my battery is or the DPU is turned off. If I plug this in, sorry for the bumpy camera. Plug it in, lock it in place. Now it does show that's, that it is plugged in, but it has the red symbol. Now this is still off. It is communicating somewhat with the base because you watch this. If I do a short press, nothing happens. But if I do a long press, we get green for a moment, then yellow, and then the DPU will switch on, on its own. So the DPU does seem to be receiving a signal through the cable. But then after about 30 seconds, there's a little bit of clicking going on inside and I get the red error light. So if you can, I'll hold it close so you can hear it. So now we've eliminated that it's the cable. It's either in this box here where the relays are, maybe a relay isn't working correctly, or there's something wrong in the DPU. But I don't suspect that because it charges fine through its AC charging port. All of the output has been tested and works fine. So again, please help me figure out what's going on here. It says here, battery three charging activation failed, error code 20, etc., etc.
I'm not going to give up. We'll figure this out. 